Vai bene, grazie. Vai bene. Grazie, chi fai? Vino al cuore. There you go. Go at him like he's going at you. father teaching his son how to box teaching him fighting skills i still remember when my stepfather taught me how to fight ah, it feels like it was yesterday you know he said hey stand right here at the top of these stairs and you know we had three floors then so you know he tells me to stand at the top of the stairs and he said you ready i said yeah and he just punched me right in my face i mean with a good one i mean he just just knocked me right down the stairs. I fell, tumbled, flipped, hit my head, scraped my knees, scraped my little penis, scraped my booty cheeks, scraped my elbows, everything. Fell right down into the basement. Hit my head on the shovel and everything. And he said, you still want to fight? Inward, I still remember it to this day. Yeah, my stepdad was a white guy. But that's none of y'all business about my mama being a Negro bedwinch. Letting that man do that shit to me. But anyways... <clears throat> And the funny thing about it is he, he acted like, a, 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 you know, like a stereotype of a black dude. You know, he used to be like, <clears throat> go to the store and give me some new ports, nigglet. And when you get back, fill out this motherfucking job application for a ninja. He used to talk like that. Anyways, man, and, and enough about my sad childhood. Anyway, the point is this, though. Man, 50 Cent is out here teaching his son how to box. I mean, and it inspired me to get up off of my 555 pound, three foot tall, blob looking ass and go lose this five pounds so I could be on fleek again. I know I gained five pounds over the holidays and everything, 2016. You know, I just don't look like myself anymore, Jesus. I need to go lose this five pounds so I could be in shape like 50. But anyways, I'm so happy to see him teaching his son these fighting skills. Then that way he'll never get knocked down a flight of stairs like I got by my stepdaddy. But anyways, well, he's in jail again, but that's none of y'all business. The point is this, though. Oh, he said he's going to beat the shit out of me when he gets out, but that's none of y'all business, too, because, well, he's saying that I stole his new girlfriend from him. Some skinny white chick. Okay, I smashed, but I didn't know that that was his woman. Anyways, now I'm snitching to myself. That was the only time I smashed a white chick, and it never happened again, but I was drunk. I asked what I was drinking, but I was drunk. The point is, though, anyways... I'm telling too much. Anyways, I, I love seeing this, man. You know, it's a good workout. He's teaching his son how to box and everything, you know, so he won't get knocked out like me. See, in my childhood, I used to just get beat up all the time. It was really, really sad. You know, I would do things like say, hmm, I think I'm going to go to the store today to get myself some bubbles gum. And I would go to get some bubbles gum. And then, like, dudes would just come out and smack me upside the head. And just, it, it was terrible. I still hear bells ringing in my head from all those ass whoopings I took as a child. But anyways, here's what 50 had to say about him teaching his son how to box. He said, he learning fast. I'm going to get him with Zab Judah daddy now. Zab Judah is, of course, a famous boxer. So I guess his dad trains people or something. I guess. Was that Tony Yayo up in the background? Nah, that wasn't Tony Yayo in the background. That's some other ninja. It just looks like him. But anyways, man, 50 cents to sell boxing gear. 50 cent had like the 50 cent punching bag and the, and the 50 cent boxing boots and all of that. I would, I would cop all that shit. Like real tall crip walk, man, I would definitely support 50. You know, it's my dude, right? But anyways, man, who do you think will win in a boxing match? Me or 50 Cent? I think I would take 50. 50 up there beating on that little boy. Hey, man, step up to a man like a blogger like me, sucker. Nah, no, I'm just kidding. No whoop my ass, 50. I'm totally kidding. I'm just being stupid. Do not beat the shit out of me. All right? I don't want to. I'm not trying to be crip walking in the wrong hood. All right? But anyways... Before I get my ass whooped, I'm going to turn this microphone off. 
do you think that he was kind of bullying his son to be whooping his ass like that? Or do you think it's it's all fair game? He's just teaching him how to fight. I think that he went a little bit too hard, in my opinion. <laughs> I mean, he didn't hit him as hard as my stepdaddy hit me. I mean, he really knocked the shit out of me. But that's none of y'all business. Let me know what y'all think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine, Meat Magazine 7 on Google Plus, and Meat Magazine blog and Instagram. I still have nightmares of hands to this day for the record.